Uh, I'm Dr. Melissa Kennedy. I'm the clinical virologist here at the University of Tennessee Veterinary Medical Center. Uh, influenza is a group of viruses that affects a number of different species, but their normal host is waterfowl. Uh, influenza is a, a very contagious virus that in birds can cause respiratory disease, gastrointestinal disease, even neurologic disease. Uh, and they can shed the virus and spread it to other birds. Um, and it can uh, negatively impact poultry operations, whether it be chickens, turkeys, etc. It can have a high mortality rate with so-called high pathogenic strains. High pathogenic strains are just that. They're very, they cause very severe disease with a very high mortality rate. Uh, some strains can be what we call low pathogenic where the disease is mild um, and of short duration. So we particularly are concerned obviously about the high pathogenic strains uh, of influenza. And it causes uh, respiratory disease, they can go off feed, they can have decreased egg production, uh, decreased or increased time to market um, for broilers, um, a very severe disease with high mortality rates. You want to try to minimize uh, or at least eliminate, if possible, uh, contact of your birds with wild waterfowl because potentially birds that are migratory can transmit the virus over long distances. We don't see the seasonality with animals that we do generally with people. With people, we come together in the winter time in shared airspace, whether it be movie theaters, malls, um, any sort of activities are generally inside, whereas in the summer we tend to be outdoors uh, more commonly. So we see more spread, more contagious, uh, the contagious nature of the virus in the wintertime with people. Uh, we don't see that with uh, other species of animals. Um, they can have potentially influenza at any time of the year. There is a potential influenza virus is notorious for spreading to other species. Um, luckily, it's not very efficient in most cases, in, in particular with these high pathogenic strains, um, but that potential is there. We saw some seasonal flu affecting dogs and cats this past year, um, and we've seen it uh, cross species lines to other mammalian species before. So it is something that is um, being monitored carefully. Symptoms can be quite vague, so the best thing to do is uh, contact your local extension agent uh, or contact the public health um, representatives in your area or in Nashville. Uh, they would be very interested, particularly if you have backyard flocks or birds that seem to be ill, you may want to contact your veterinarian and have them contact the appropriate authorities for you. Again, it's very uncommon for the bird flu to spread to other species, but it is a potential threat. Uh, we've seen high pathogenic strains in Asia spread to people from birds. So it is a, a possibility, but it's quite um, rare that we could expect that, and uh, we don't anticipate and haven't seen any evidence of that yet with this particular strain of flu. But as far as directly impacting your life, it's probably going to be minimal.